بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم نحمده ونصلي ونسلم على رسوله الكريم أما بعد In life we see that two people can be doing the same action but one person can be an expert on that action and his action will have a bigger output a way bigger effect for example imagine if there is an expert of karate next to me and I punch a person versus if that person per punches a person his punch is going to have a way bigger impact than my punch with this punch he can probably break a board with my punch I can probably break my knuckles so what's really interesting is that we also need to strive in creating emphasis and worth within our deeds and our actions with Almighty Allah. In Islam, our deeds are not counted, they are weighed by Almighty Allah. And the more sincere our actions are going to be, the more they are going to weigh on the Day of Judgment. One way to do that was taught to us by the angel Jibra'il, Gabriel, alayhi salam upon him be peace he came in front of the prophet of allah in the shape of a human being while all the other companions watched they didn't know who he was and when he came he asked the prophet of allah peace and blessings be upon him a series of questions and one of those questions was that he asked him mal ihsan what is Excellence. How does a person create excellence within their deeds? And the Prophet of Allah, may Allah send peace and blessings upon him, replied, That in order to create excellence within your deeds, what we need to do is that we need to worship Allah as if we can see Almighty Allah. Because if we were to see the boss, the creator, we would not be messing around in our deeds. We would not be, uh, we would be very mindful on the way that we do every little thing. And the Prophet of Allah, peace and blessings be upon him, said, let's say your imagination does not allow you that, then at least worship Allah by keeping in mind that definitely he can see you. We ask Almighty Allah to put an impact in all of our deeds, to guide us towards the right path, and to accept whatever that we do for his cause.